Hi everyone. Oh man, I have a bit of a scare with my iPhone. It was, um, battery was getting really low and then it was at 1% for like an hour. Like, and I was using it and then it finally died. Um, and it was at like 15%, so I knew it was going to die eventually. And then I plugged into the charger. It showed it was charging. Went to bed, wake up the next morning, nothing. Not even like hitting the button and getting the battery signal. So I thought, oh no, my iPhone's finally fried. But apparently it just didn't continue charging after I was done. But I plugged it in and functional. Anyway, I haven't even taken my shower yet, but my hair looks all right, you know? Um, and in this little dark space, this is where I'm gonna spend most of my time today, writing for my screenplay. Because I've got, I can't find the switch. This is the movie room where I live. We literally have a movie room down here. There's a projector right up there, white wall to project onto. We even have old sets of theater seats. I shouldn't say we. I mean, I moved in with my girlfriend and her family. It's their movie room. But And um, if you watch my amateur story channel, I do story videos about you know famous crimes that have happened in the local area. There's always a red uh, wall behind me. Well, this is the wall that I stand against when I do that. So if you ever go watch any of my amateur story videos, that's where it was. You'll even notice there's a little white mark next to me. And it's this pin that I can't get out of the wall. Try though, I'm, I do. Anyway, so I've got seating. I've got a table to sit at. This is like the perfect height for me to sit at and write without hunching over too much, without having to like write like the papers a million miles away. I've got a lot of orange munchies and energy drink and well, my that's not relevant, but I'm getting ready. This is going to be my day for the most part. Here's my board, which I still have. To, I have a lot of more note cards to add to, but this is my organizational board, and there's a lot of room in this room for it. So I can just set that down and open it when I need to. Add more cards, and then I know the outline of the film so that while I'm writing, I have a better idea of what scene's going into what. So even if I'm writing and I get a scene done, if, if I'm like, wait, what happens after this? I can look at the thing, boom, know right where I'm going. And uh, yeah, here's all the note cards, some of which have been written on. Just everything scatterbrained. This is my, uh, my notebook for my film. This is all notes taken from hours of voice memos I've taken as I'm putting the movie together in my head and all that and uh, the this rest of the notebook here is for just uh, screenwriting but the first um, like like these first two sections here are all just for note taking getting the film ready to go so that as I screenwrite I have any references I need there at my disposal and there's no confusion So, I thought somebody was coming down here. Happens from time to time. And I've also got my T and my uh, iPhone, holding my iPhone, my cell phone, in case there's any issues. And I was originally planning on going out somewhere today, but I write best in a park. It's too cold and potentially rainy to do anything in a park. And none of these other places, coffee shops, sneaking into a college, <laughs> were grabbing at me. I really don't want to have to go really far away to finally sit down and write, um, but I need something a little different from my usual workspace, which is kind of just sitting here at my computer. I just, I needed something different. So, uh, I mean, what the hell? The next room over works for me. Yeah, I'm going to be in here, well, I mean, until my head starts hurting, I guess. I should have ibuprofen in here with me <laughs> in case something happens, because I will get a headache with or without the caffeine. <laughs> 